Regina Elisabeta II a fost absentă luni de la discursul tronului în Parlament, ceremonie solemnă în democrația britanică. Aceasta a lipsit din cauza unor probleme de mobilitate și a fost înlocuită de prințul Charles. Este a treia oară în cei 70 de ani de domnie în care regina nu participă la eveniment. Iată care a fost discursul prințului Charles. Government's priority is to grow and strengthen the economy and help ease the cost of living for families. Her Majesty's Government will level up opportunity in all parts of the country and support more people into work. Her Majesty's Ministers will continue to support the police to make the streets safer and fund the National Health Service to reduce the COVID backlogs. In these challenging times, Her Majesty's Government will play a leading role in defending democracy and freedom across the world, including continuing to support the people of Ukraine. Her Majesty's Government will drive economic growth to improve living standards and fund sustainable investment in public services. This will be underpinned by a responsible approach to the public finances, reducing debt while reforming and cutting taxes. Her Majesty's Ministers will support the Bank of England to return inflation to its target. De comemorare pentru prințul Filip din Marte a fost singurul eveniment public la care a participat regina în acest an. Queen wouldn't want to disappoint the people of Northern Ireland and so she will have taken this decision very reluctantly. But obviously at the age of 95, considering all the engagements that she's been doing recently, it's not at all surprising that she's tired. And let's hope that after a few days rest, she will be um, back under, undergoing public engagements again.